Minister of Health Terence Dialsing says no matter the allocation in the upcoming 2017-2018 budget, his ministry will ensure the country gets value for money. Last year, the health sector got a minimal increase in the 2017 budget, moving from $6.088 billion to $6.25 billion. Speaking at the top of ceremony for the new Arima Hospital, Minister Dialsing listed some areas the money was spent. Every last cent that we allocated and we got value for money. Inside I spoke about the fact that the old UDCOT was going to get $500 million more on these two hospital projects. Coming in as Minister of Health, we went to UDCOT and we got a half billion dollar savings. Three's accomplishments for 2017. The launch, as the, the launch of the NCD plan. That NCD plan is going to change the face of the way the country thinks about itself. Two, the fact that we moved this country from 6,000 doses of flu vaccine to 70,000. No one has died. And three, our continuing drive to get maternal deaths down to low single digits. And four, managing the nation's drug supply. And Minister Dial Singh says the new Arima Hospital should be up and running by 2019. He was speaking at the top of ceremony earlier today. Marie Hull reports. Wednesday marked a milestone in the construction of the new Arima Hospital. And what that ceremony marks is the end of one phase and the beginning of a new phase. So now you can have internal work start, plumbing, electrical, gypsum work, partitions, ceilings. All of those internal works can now take place out of the glare of the elements, the weather, the rains. Health Minister Terence Yalsing expects the Rima Hospital, which should be able to hold 150 beds, to be completed in two years. This hospital is due to be finished sometime within the first quarter of 2019. So we hope to have it finished between February, March, and if we have to go over into the second quarter of 2019, we never know in construction what may happen, weather conditions, whatever. With the advent of the new hospital, what happened to the Arima Health District facility? All a &E work will now be done at this new hospital, and that old facility will be converted to deliver primary care services. What do I mean by primary care services? All your clinics, all your outpatient clinics will now take place there. Leaving this 150 bed facility as a pure secondary facility. The new Arima Hospital is being constructed at a cost of $1.2 billion by the China Real Reconstruction Corporation. That company had previously constructed the new Scarborough Hospital. Marie Hall, C News.